medical technology has evolved to the point of beyond amazing. Today, doctors can transplant limbs and cure thousands of diseases. Knowing that, did you know that there are still medical conditions that baffle the experts worldwide? Around the world, there are children born with strange defects that make you wonder how such things are possible. There are cases so unusual that you may not even believe them to be true. Have you ever heard of the boy with giant legs or the child called the mermaid girl? Such incidents may not have been sensationalized, but they do exist, and they are true. From the baby with the red nose to the turtle boy, here are 10 children born with the most unbelievable and unusual medical conditions that have no logical explanation. Stick around until the end of the video and check out our number one pick, because that might just be the strangest case of all. The Boy with Giant Hands Mohammed Kalim is eight years old, but his life has been ruined by a cruel and isolating condition. Mohammed Kalim lives with his parents in a small village of Jharkhand, India. Known as the boy with giant hands, Kalim was discovered through social media in 2015 when he was eight years old. Kalim suffers from a rare form of giantism that causes his hands to grow out of proportion. Try as they might, but medical experts baffled about his condition are still figuring out a cure. Kalim's hands are over 13 inches in length and weigh over 17 pounds each. Holy cow. Because of his disability, he has been stigmatized by many in his village, attributing his condition to superstitious reasons. His parents have been promised help by reconstructive surgeons. But on a lighter note, hey, Kalim, we bet those hands could pack a wallop too, little brother. So don't let anyone get you down. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for y'all that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. <laughs> Try it. It really works. The Boy with Giant Legs If you thought the first one was strange, wait till you hear about Vincent Oketch, The Boy with Giant Legs. The 10-year-old boy who passed away in 2013 suffered from a bizarre and extreme condition of elephantiasis, causing his legs to grow every day. For 13-year-old Vincent, even sitting had become a mammoth task and was scheduled for an operation in Kasubi. That was never to be, because Vincent's conditions took a turn for the worse. Doctors feared that he may also have been suffering from a flesh-eating disease called necrotizing fasciitis. Vincent succumbed to heart failure. Turtle Boy This boy wants to be just like any other child his age. This ought to cheer you up a little bit. Called the Turtle Boy, young Didier Montalvo from Colombia suffered from a rare and unusual condition. Much like Quasimodo without a hump, Didier lived most of his young life with a giant mole attached to his back. The growth was so large, it resembled a turtle shell, earning him the nickname of Turtle Boy. Didier wanted to be just like any other boy, and his condition didn't stop him from playing or living just like any other child. When funding help came from the UK in 2011, doctors diagnosed his condition as a rare illness called congenital melanocytic nevus CMN, in 2011. Thanks to a leading UK plastic surgeon, Neil Bulstrode, who operated on him for free, Didier was given a second chance to grow up as a regular child. Speaking about Didier's condition, Dr. Bulstrode said it was as if the boy permanently carried a huge sack of potatoes on his back. Boy, what a load to be lifted. Thank you, doctor, for your generous help. On Chi Many of us have birthmarks. Some women even love flaunting that tiny mole on the upper lip. But what would you do if you had a birthmark covering half your face? That's exactly what a young boy from China grew up with. Eight-year-old An Qi from Jilin province of China baffled doctors with the condition of a huge, hairy birthmark covering half his face. From birth, it just kept on growing. Stigmatized and bullied for his condition, An Qi was soon relieved when he received free surgery from the Jilin Minyi Plastic Surgery Hospital. Doctors removed what was essentially a large mole. Didn't look like a large mole, it looks like a comb over, you know, you know, like this kind of covers half his face. Could be a trend. Fascinating. 
Milagro Siran, the Mermaid Girl If you thought mermaids don't exist, then you've never heard of Milagro Siran. This little girl from Peru was born with a rare condition called Siranomelia, also known as the Mermaid Syndrome. Milagros's legs were joined at the ankles, making it unable for her to walk. She had to be carried everywhere and looked like a mermaid. Milagros underwent several surgeries to correct her condition and separate her legs. Through sheer determination, she was able to walk again. The mermaid syndrome is an extremely rare congenital disorder that causes deformities of the lower spine and lower limbs. It occurs in approximately 1 in 60,000 to 100,000 births and even affects organs like the kidneys, which Milagros was battling with till the age of 15. She ultimately passed away from kidney failure. Goodbye, my little mermaid. What a gift you would have had for this world. Connie Lloyd, the baby with a red nose. Here's a little baby who looked like she wore a clown's nose that stuck on permanently. When cute Connie Lloyd was four weeks old, her parents noticed the weird red birthmark on her nose getting larger. It may have been amusing because here was a regular baby Patch Adams, or you could even say Rudolph. What made her cuter was her infectious smile, but her parents were concerned. Doctors feared that the birthmark was growing internally, and if injured, could result in the little baby bleeding to death. Fortunately, doctors performed a life-saving surgery on Connie that lasted three and a half hours. Connie's red nose is now history, just like Patch Adams and Rudolph in our history, just back there. We still see them every now and then in the movies, but yeah, you know, gone, kaput, wrinkle in time. Shiloh Pepin Like Milagro Seron, Shiloh Pepin was another girl suffering from the dreaded mermaid syndrome, or Seronomelia. Shiloh was born in 1999 with the fatal condition where children are not expected to live long. The condition of her legs being fused together was not the dangerous issue here. Shiloh, unfortunately, was missing several organs, like her uterus, bladder, and large intestine. She didn't have a vaginal vault or a rectum, which meant there was no way for food or liquid to evacuate her body. However, Shiloh still managed to live till the age of 10, when she sadly passed away at the main medical center near her Kenny Bunkport home. Jonathan Pitry, the Butterfly Boy I'm already past half my life, so when you think about that, you know, it gives you a new perspective. This is an amazing story. Jonathan Pitry, the Butterfly Boy, is a shining example of strength of human spirit. Suffering from an incurable genetic disorder called epidermal lysis bullosa since birth, Jonathan was always in pain. His rare condition, considered one of the most painful in modern medicine, it caused his fragile and tender skin to keep tearing and blistering. In spite of his condition, Jonathan inspired many and moved doctors and caregivers with his positive attitude. Jonathan spent his entire childhood and teenage life in and out of hospitals, undergoing operations and treatments to improve his quality of life. Unfortunately, in October 2018, just when many felt his condition was improving after receiving stem cell transfusion, Jonathan passed away. He will always be remembered for his pioneering effort to raise awareness about his condition. In the end, performing the ultimate hat trick. The Mask Boy Among children with unusual birth defects, there is none so strange as the condition of the Mask Boy. Hui Kang Xiao is a little boy from Hunan Province in China who was born with a horrifying facial deformity that gave him the appearance of wearing a skin-colored opera mask. The little child's rare birth defect moved millions in China, who even donated thousands to improve his condition. But, to no avail, the boy's defect resulted in two large gaps from both sides of his mouth all the way to his ears. When doctors examined him and performed scans, they found that most of Wei Kong's soft tissues were damaged, broken, and moved. His sphenoid bone, upper jaw, cheekbones, and temporal bone were also damaged. Poor guy couldn't get a break, could he? The World's Hairiest Girl (laughs) 
At number one, we have Supatra Sassufan, the world's hairiest girl. Supatra was born with a rare birth defect called hypertrichosis that makes her hair keep on growing. The condition affecting a number of others worldwide is caused by a faulty chromosome and is also known as the werewolf syndrome. Supatra has thick hair growing all over her head, face, neck, arms, back, and legs. Her family has tried laser treatments to no avail. In fact, the older she got, the thicker the hair. Supatra's condition also earned her a place in the Guinness Book of World Records. Fortunately for Supatra, now 19 years old, has found ways to manage her hair and is leading a normal life after even meeting the man of her dreams. So which one of these kids has fascinated you the most? Let me know in the comments below and I'll handpick and feature your comment in the next video. So look out for your comment. And now it's time for a featured comment from one of our previous videos. This one's from the World's Heaviest People episode. PB says, I was eating and I saw this and stopped because I'm 200 pounds. And then I decided to go on a diet. I'm so glad this video motivated you to take better care of your health. I'm sure you'll lose the weight in no time.